Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to talk to you about our lateral COVID test. Yeah, it's a, um, this is from work actually. So all the staff, we are given each box. Yes, because apparently we have to do the test, the COVID-19 lateral test twice a week. Can you imagine that? so but this is self not the the ones that we have to go swab dig into your nose but you still have to dig into your nose but uh, this is to be done by yourself and it's just like pregnancy test or drug test something like that the kit okay so i'm going to show to you what's inside this box yeah this is given at work I work in the NHS, it's National Health Insurance in the UK. So as a frontliner, we have to know to make sure that we're not carriers. We are the helpers instead. Okay, let's go. i show you. Okay, it says there Innova Medical Group. So IVD. So I, that's the name of the company. Innova. Yeah. So it's... Innova SARS-2 CoV-2 antigen rapid quality test. So it's a kind of a rapid uh, swab test. Okay, so I'm going to show what's inside of the uh, kit or the box, the self uh, swab assessment test. So we have here the uh, disposable swab. This is the one that we dig into your nose, okay? So this is about quite a few inside there because can you imagine we have the test twice a week? And then we have this test tube, like um, a tube with the um, nozzle cup. So to um, that's, that's where we have to put the solution in there. Yeah, so that's the one. And then of course we have this instruction uh, leaflet how to do the antigen rapid quality test yeah that's the instruction leaflet and then of course we have the actual uh, cartridge the test cartridge you see it's just like when you do pregnancy tests or when you do drug tests so yeah same kind of uh, way you just need to put the solution and and we'll wait and see what's the result okay even though you don't have any symptom you still have to do the test this is to detect early and we know when can you be isolated and that means you'll be off work so we have about i think we have about quite a few pieces in there. 20 plus 25 something like that so this is good to for about a few weeks for us right so i'm going to start the test yeah but because we have um, instructed that there's a video that we need to follow okay i'm going to listen to the video and i'm going to do it at the same time at least i'll be guided accordingly let's see okay right okay So lateral flow COVID-19 test. So the test should be done correctly, that's what it says there. And so for the test result to come in, you have to have at least 13 
minutes to allow the test to finish. Yes, but you're not allowed to put it in the fridge or freezer. It's just in the room air. Room air, yes, room temperature. Me too. So before you start, you have to blow your nose or clean your nose. And then uh, you have to check your equipment. Okay. So it should be full, performed immediately when you do the swab. Yeah. So you do not do a swab and then leave it and then come back. It should be done straight away. So you see, this is the swab. It's just very, quite a small, you know, enough for you to get small discomfort. So, okay, I need to do that. Swirl 10, 10 seconds at time. Insert the swab into the extraction tube containing the solution. Swirl the swab tip in the solution fluid against the wall inside the extraction tube, squeezing the tube from the outside. Now place the cap on the extraction tube. The solution bottle should be firmly sealed between each use. Once the swab is done, we begin the test process. The swab specimens should be tested immediately after collection. Dispense drops of this specimen vertically into the specimen well on the device. Do not handle or move the test device until the test is complete and ready for reading. Set a timer for 30 minutes. The letter C is the control line, meaning that the test is valid. If it is not there, the test is invalid and should be repeated using a new device. The T line indicates the test result. If it is present, the test is positive. A positive test will have two lines, a C line and a T line. If the test is positive, the member of staff will need to self-isolate and contact their occupational health department or line manager and arrange a PCR test. If the test is negative, continue with your normal activity, and if it is invalid, you will need to take the test again. Finally, dispose of the device, any liquid solution and the swab in the household waste. Now please remember the following key points. Read the instructions prior to performing the test. Do not eat or smoke while handling your specimen. Be careful not to splash the swab or solution. If you do have an accident, clean up any spills thoroughly using a household disinfectant. Do not ingest the solution and store the extract solution as recommended out of reach of children and animals. Thank you for taking the time to watch this film. So that means I'm still healthy and I still can work. That's what it means. Um, negative test result, meaning I'm not infected. I've got no virus in me, so I can continue serving people and serving patients, serving others. Thank you guys. Thank you for listening. And I'll see you next time. 
Bye. Like, comment, and subscribe.